Today I'm going to tell you about selection sort using programming in C. So let me open first of all those books so I can open the C. First of all I have to mount the C drive so I can move to the C drive and open the C language. <coughs> so after that you can just zoom it for full screen. Okay. You can visit my website as well www.sciencemicrosystems.com www.sciencemicrosystems.com And you can also add me on Skype You can also subscribe to my channel for more videos Let's start first of all Selection sort So first of all, what is selection sort? As in, as we all know, sorting is two points like ascending order and descending order. Okay, so we can sort any element, number of elements using array, uh, like for ascending and descending order. But there are various method to sort arrays using selection sort, bubble sort. So right now we are going to do selection sort using C. Now, <clears throat> basically, we have a number of elements like 12, 4, 5, 78. You can assume any numbers like 1. Okay, so these, these are the five elements. So, this location I'm specifying, these are the five elements starting from 0 to 4. So, size is 5. Array size is, and you can see on the zeroth location, thus a number of, uh, the element is 12, and on first position is 4, and second position 5, on third position is 78, and on fourth position it's 4. So now, for the selection sort, you can use. Uh, you can compare first element to all of all of the below elements if any of the element is greater than that element then you can swap that element okay like if you will compare 12 is greater than if 12 is greater than 4 it's true yes true then you can swap this element okay so swapping means the self number one position element will be moved to the first uh, zero position and zero position element will move to the first position so now new elements will be like 4 12 5 78 and 1. now again this position will check again the third number 4 is greater than 5 no condition false 4 is greater than 78 no condition false 4 is greater than 1 yes it's true now it will again swap these values so 4th will go to the 4th position and 1 will, one will go to the 0th position 1 to 5 78 and then ok now next time 12 will be checked sec first position will be checked for all the below elements now we will check for the second position 12 is greater than 5 yes it's true then it will swap these elements 1 5 12 78 and 4 then again this on first position which element is now 5 5 is greater than 78 now condition false ok now again it will check the fourth position 5 is greater than 4 yes it's true now it will again swap this value now current elements are 1 4 12 78 and 
पाई ओके नाउ इट विल चेक टू द थर्ड पोजीशन एंड इन एरेज पोजीशन विल बी सेकंड ऑन सेकंड पोजीशन वी आर हैविंग 12 एलिमेंट इट विल चेक टू द 78 इज नो कंडीशन फॉल्स अगेन इट विल चेक टू द 12 इज ग्रेटर देन टू 5 यस इट्स ट्रू नाउ इट विल अगेन स्वैप 1 4 5 6 Seventeen will which remain same and twelve will move to the fourth position. Okay, now it will again check to the third position. On third position we are having a seventy-eight number. Seventy-eight will check to the below twelve. Yeah, it, it's true. Yes, again it will swap this number. One, four, five, twelve, and seventy-eight. This kind of swapping. Using selection sort, we can do. In the selection sort, it will it will check from the one element for of the top to the below all elements. Okay, so like in first, you you can check. I have just checked twelve to four, five, seventeen, and one. Then again, I uh, I checked twelve to below elements, and then five and seventeen and four. So this kind of selection sort, I'm going to write the code. For the selection sort here, Now you can input these variables. So now this is the input of five elements, and now I will write the code logic to. Calculate the sorting method. Now we compare the solution like A O five greater than A O J. Then it will swap. So to swap these numbers, I will use the temporary variable, and I will move the temporary value, and then I have five. Two, one, two, J will be moved by the temporary variable. Now I will print the this output of the sorting elements. Slash T, so you can see uh, in tab form. I think I have done. Now let's save this code. I will enter forty-five, twelve, fifty-six, twelve, eight, and one. Sorry, I just forgot to add that signature. I know. Ah, uh, oh sorry, I just had entered two times. Twelve, five, and one. Uh, oh, sorry, I just forgot to be. I need to go forty percent to be. 
I think it's crashed. One more top on it. So here I have to display yes element to percentage DM. I will run this program. Run up 578. So you can see these are sorted elements 1, 5, 12, 45, and 70. You can also change the order as well. So now, right now, you can see it's in ascending order. If you will set here less than here. Uh, it will be in descending mode. Okay, now you can say higher number element is first of all, then it decreasing step by step. So this is the descending order. Okay, so you can change ascending and descending, sorting and selection sort as well. Thank you so much, friends. If you like, share as well as and subscribe to my channel as well as for watch for further videos as well. So I will record in my next video for bubble sort as well. Thank you so much.